Hey now, we got some all-stars. Hey guys, what's up? Someone's on 20 here. Oh, because we got another NHL 21 Hockey Ultimate Team video. Today, EA dropped the Hot All-Stars event. And it's, it's actually kind of dope. That is right. We have the Hot All-Stars. You guys see the 94 overall. Denny Savard, Shane Doan, Serge Savard, Keith Kachuk. They're pretty good. But these cards, this is what we're talking about. 97 McDavid, kind of a bummer considering I just grinded for that 97 McDavid, but it is what it is. Johnny Gaudreau, Mitch Marner, Morgan Riley, Tyson Berry, and Tri-City Americans legend, Carey Price. We also dig in a 94 overall, Al Ifrady. All right, so looking at these cards that we got with the, the North All-Star, so basically today we got the North Division, to, on Monday we're gonna get a different division, on next Friday we're gonna get a different division, and next Monday we're gonna get a different division, so every Monday and Friday we're gonna get division cards. So we got the North today, the McDavid, is unreal now basically what they did here is they released two types of the cards obviously not two the same overall hello goose same overall but different synergies so obviously looking at the mcdavid two balance two light the, or one light the lamp one shutdown goose is back and better than ever he just really wants to be on camera um two barrage one gladiator one magician like it just sucks knowing that i just grinded for a 97 mcdavid and these just dropped but looking at this mitch marner Oh my, maybe one of the best right-handed wingers in the game right now. Uh, maxed out, or 95 speed with distributor. Two distributor, pass and play miracle wingman. Or this is the one I am in love with. Spark, light the lamp, and workhorse. Up to 97 balance. Obviously 98 excel. Gets up to 95 speed with the distributor. 99 wrist shot. Martyr's build in game is actually nuts. So um, I don't know, man. It's yeah, I really like that Martyr card. Looking at Tri City Americans legend Carey Price, two barrage, heart and soul, and spark. I really like Carey Price in game. So I'm all about it. And this one's really good too. Two swarm, one distributor, one balance. Very, very nice looking cards there. The fact that you're just sitting here is adorable, Goose. So cute. Now on the defensive side of things, we did get a 94 overall Morgan Riley, two spark passing playmaker and shutdown. I haven't used a Morgan Riley card all year, but this card does look really, really good. Um, obviously synergy is really good. And then his other one is two distributor, gladiator, and then light the lamp, also a really nice card. And on defense, robbing Jeff Petrie, we have Tyson Berry, two barrage, one light the lamp, one workhorse. I'm not a huge fan of Barry in game. Uh, and then his other card has two swarm, howitzer, and shutdown. Now we did also get Johnny Goudreau, who I forgot played in the NHL to be honest two balance howitzer gladiator obviously you know where you're getting out of johnny goudreau and then his other card has swarm passing playmaker and wingman now looking at the alumni so they all got a 94 overall here's the shane Doan. good synergies on him too distributor like lamp workhorse obviously for whatever reason they made all the alumni really really slow so it, it does suck that don't slower um 89 speed and it gets up to 93 excel so it's not the worst card out there i think don't's probably the best alumni and they murdered my boy danny savard heart and soul speedster magician gets up to 90 94 speed but stays at up to 90 excel like i don't know man i don't know why they did all these alumni dirty like obviously shane don't's not the best skater but like denny savard wasn't a bad skater whatsoever so uh brutal to see a denny savard car that i probably won't use until i have my all-time hawks team but nonetheless denny savard and we have surge savard uh with spark howitzer and shutdown again too slow of a card gets up to 90 or 89 speed but like 63210 he's he's too slow i don't know man and then we did get uh, a walt big walt keith kachuk barrage wingman magician again speed's all right gets up to 94 excel with wingman activated and then gets up to 91 uh speed so not the worst cards but like i think the, the kachuk's probably the best one but i don't know man i just wish the alumni had more speed. now i will say all these alumni did get a 91 overall version and they got an 88 overall version basically use the objectives uh collectibles that you get by doing the objectives and you use those with gold collectibles you get some of these and i'll go over the objectives real quick so looking at the objectives it's kind of the same as as the one the last one the nhl moments one basically you, you complete all these objectives you get all-star event collectibles and then you use those collectibles one way or another now i will say all the sets aren't out we have the majority of them and honestly the only important ones 18 gold collectibles for a random 94 overall tradable alumni so kachuk doan or the savards and then looking at the collectible sets you need trade in nine of them and you get an all-star high score pack which i don't recommend you doing in reality like I, I guess if you don't want to spend any gold collectibles which i don't blame you but it's still dumb that you, you can't get a player um if you trade in four of them and two gold collectibles you get an 88 and then if you trade in eight gold collectibles and then what six all-star collectibles you get a 91 and then for the 94s is insane to me 
you need eight uh what is that 12 gold collectibles and eight gold and eight uh all-star objectives why would anyone ever do this like at the end of the day man why couldn't they give out the 88s without gold collectibles like who's dropping 140k to get an 88 search of art you know what i mean like i don't know man like i understand that they have to balance it out somehow but an 88 overall you can't give us for free it's tough now like i said all the sets aren't out yet we do have the north set um we do have a random north division player tradable uh for 18 gold collectibles probably not worth it obviously you can get the tradable mcdavid but there's gonna be a lot of goudreaux out of that we do have uh, a 90 over, you get both of the johnny goudreaux uh for base johnny goudreaux and how many collectibles eight eight gold collectibles actually not terrible obviously it's untradeable but you get both of them which i think is kind of cool and then i already did this one but we, we have 75 gold players for two gold collectibles obviously worth doing so i hope we get more sets like this for the johnny goudreaux because i'm a huge fan of that mitch marner card if i can get both of them the distributor and the spark one i'm all about it so hopefully we get more sets like that you guys will know by now though oh geez as i was talking to get both of the mitch marners you need 20 gold collectibles it seems like a lot which obviously you get 295 overalls but 20 gold collectibles that's a lot that's like what 1.4 oh lord so i can only expect for the mcdavid's it's gonna be base mcdavid and i don't know man it's gonna be expensive to get the mcdavid i don't know how i'm gonna feel about that now obviously they're gonna keep adding on to these sets and obviously as the new divisions are released we'll get the central we'll get the uh the what is the other one called the west and then the east or whatever the other one's called i don't really know we're gonna get more of those but let's just get into packs all right but looking at the packs we actually we got really good special packs but the all-star packs are the exact same as we've had for a hot minute you get a guaranteed gold collectible 83 plus 20 players to this pack's terrible than the, the the red one whatever they're all terrible outside of the blue one but we do get two ultimate choice packs jumbo elite players packs mega packs and player packs so let's open some packs all right first one here big money no whammy hope hopefully i get a gold collectible that would be sick noah gregor big money no whammy we are ripping 12k Bang! Untradeable Evgeny Kuznetsov with like the lamp and distributor. Oh my god! I was just shouting out verified and, and donator, but oh my goodness gracious! Oh my goodness gracious! Now I I I'm, I may have to try and use this card. Like I said, when the uh, Style Master or Style Icon, whatever it was called, or Anisha Mo, whatever it was, I'm not a huge fan of Kuzi's build. But oh my goodness gracious! I don't hate a 91 overall. I'm getting exclusive nets off. I don't hate it. If that's uh, if that's any uh, premonition about what we're gonna pull in this ultimate choice pack, then I am chilling like a villain. Like I said, haven't pulled a master set. Wouldn't hate a Connor McDavid or a Mitch Marner. Uh, but oh my goodness gracious! Now I'm holding on to my gold collectibles uh, for the the central division. Obviously, in case we get a Debrin Cat, in case we get a Kane. But oh my goodness gracious! What a time to be alive! I love, oh, poor Jack Echo. I love Evgeny Kuznetsov now. Going on to round three here. Big money, no way. I mean, dude, I, I don't know if I can play, complain. I mean, obviously, I wish it was tradable. I would have sold him instantly, but I'll take it, man. All right, round four. So far, first one's been brutal. We get two of these bad boys. Alec Martinez, Connor Sheary, Anthony Mantha, and Mika Zabinijan. He is a 90 overall prime time out right now. Six, six goals and six assists against the Flyers this month. Is that good? Is that good? Last round, Bo Horvat, Steven Samkos, Oof, Justin Hall, nice. Not a great first ultimate choice pack, but you know what? We're chilling like a villain. Big, uh, here, we'll do a G Fuel pack. A big G Fuel pack, a sip every round. Sip every round, let's go. First round. Mm. Delicious, Martin Jones, Dougie Hamilton, and Aaron Dell. Round two. Another Mika. Morgan Riley, could have been his 94. Tough scenes. Bobby Laner, what a time. All right, round three. Not great, not great. Round four, uh, I'm getting, whew, I am gonna be wired, let's go. <sighs> Round five, that's all that matters. Round five, all right, let's go. Big money, no whammy. Wow, what a pack. Not great. I, we did get Morgan Riley and uh, who did we get at the end of there? I think I got Marner or uh, someone else. I don't know. Not great though. Not great. I think those are all I can open to those. Not great. Let's move on to the Jumbo Elite Players Pack. 
We saw plenty of points. We're chilling. We got koozie. Wouldn't mind something to boost the coin total. We're running low on coins nowadays. Nick Ritchie, how are you? Carter Hart, I'm dropping him for my fantasy lineup. Fun fact. Mike Smith, Nick Bonino, Keith Yandel, Brett Burns, Braden Holtby, Andre Cash. Not great. Not great. All right, I think I get three of these, so we should be ending off with all these. I mean, I don't know, man, but pff, these have been brutal. Let's see. Skip. 89 team of the week, Adam Henrique. Could have been worse. Kind of a good card, actually. That's actually kind of a low-key good card. Obviously, 89. I'll take it. Drew Doughty, Tyler Sagan. I just cannot expect that guy goes for too much. Jeff Petrie got robbed. All right, I think I got one more of these. We did pull an 89 and a 91 Kuznets. nuts. So I can't even open more of those. All right, and actually, the Mega Packs have better odds than the Green Packs, so we'll rip open these Mega Packs. Hope for something decent, but big money, no whammy. We'll skip. We did not get a purple in this one. Did we get anything? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, man. Dude, as, and now that I think about it, the koozie's nice and all, but I, pro I don't know if I'll ever use him, to be honest, man. No purples, but we did get some 81 pluses. None other than Elias Patterson, Rocco Grimaldi, big four goal guy, and Barclay Goudreau. What is all right, I think we get one more of these mega packs. Big money, no whammy. Come on. Come on. Like I said, can't be too upset with the koozie, but... Was hoping for a big pull, to be honest. I was hoping for a master set, which I guess there aren't really any master sets. There's just like the Marner in them, but wouldn't I wouldn't hate pulling one of those. All right, down to our last one here. Players pack. All in all, we got a bunch of gold players. We got Koozie. I don't know, man. I was hoping for something big. Jordan Bennington is not big. Ox Legend, Trevor Daly. But yeah, at the end of the day, pretty decent event. I'm hoping for the best as we, hopefully we get more Hawks cards. That's all, basically what I'm saying. But either way, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, please leave a like. It really does help out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, let me know. I'll talk to you later. Come on!